uh, zero, uh, the second gym location. So, Cerulean, so, Cerulean, Cerulean, you know what? You know exactly where we're going. So, let's continue on. We are now leaving Mount Moon and heading to, I always mess this word up, Cerulean City. Yeah, I think I got it right that time. We're off to hopefully take on Misty, the gym leader. And I think take care of Team Rocket as well. Find all the people on the bridge. And to really find out if Bill is in this game. Because in normal Pokemon games, you have to send your Pokemon to somewhere else when you get more than six. But now they're in, actually in your bag. So my question is, is Bill still in this game? Or have they replaced him with someone else? And at some point, I still need to do the mystery gift to get my uh, Mew out of... Oh, come on now. Get the Mew out of my Pokeball. You know, because I'm still using the Pokeball Plus controller. Which, <laughs> like I said it last time, it is a lot easier to get. Uh, since my last stream, actually, we have beaten Brock, gone through all of Mount Moon, and now, you know, just do what we can. Oh, Pidgey found something. What'd you find? Uh-huh. Yeah? There we go. Probably a raspberry or something. Or a non-nam berry. Alright. The Rattata there. Not looking for Rattatas. And once again, I am just going through... Uh, if I see a... Oh, there he is! Sandro! Yes! Getting that. Alright. Once again, going through the game, if I come across uh, a Pokemon I haven't caught yet, I'll hold off on that. But Sandro is one of the top few ones I've been waiting to get this entire time. So. Wait for it. Oh, yes! Excellent! Oh, come on! I should have done a great ball, but it's all good. Let's do it again. Ah. Tad too late on that one. And if you hear that noise in the background, uh, that is actually the Pokestop controller itself. The po sorry, the Pokemon Plus controller itself. Sanchez data will be added. Super excited. He's one of my tops I've been waiting for. Actually, was that a... Huh. Alright. There it is. Pokeball. Oh, nice. Three great balls. Huh. Well, I gotta get Surf to get there and... If correct, Mewtwo is back there. I'll get you one day. And it looks like a Pokemon trainer coach is back there too. Alright, let's play the talk to everyone game real quick. See if there's any cool, exciting information. Oh, I get the bike in this episode this uh segment. City. I can't think of words. Just go to the hardware store and get some shears. Cut it down. Hey, Bubblezor. <gasps> um. Yeah, 37. Yeah, I'll take another Bubblezor. I mean, he's. Bubblezor is able to be found in the forest, but hey. Free Bubblezor. Ooh, he's. Sl slightly smaller. Hey, it's a Sand True. Alright. Well, real quick, we got a new Pokemon. Uh, this was actually one of the Bubblezors you're supposed to receive. Because in this game, you also receive one of each starter as well. 
Uh, it is a level 12 version. Mine is currently 14. Um, let's have a look. Alright. Check summary. Jolly and modest. What does that mean here? So Jolly has... Come on. Of course, I mean, my, Jolly's currently two levels higher. Speed and attack are both good. But this one has just attack and attack. I'll hang on to this Bulbasaur for a while just to see... It potentially could be something great. Oh. <laughs> All right, we'll go to the water fountain. Is shooting out water. Sure, we'll throw in 500. That's a. Oh, that's good. It's like Pidgey. Oh, come on, Pidgey. What is it, Pidgey? I can't do anything else to the fountain. I've already given it the max amount of uh, money I could give it. <gasps> the bike store. I, yeah, I mean, I can't wait to lock it. Hopefully, you can unlock it in this game. This is still like a million. A shiny bike. It looks very fast. Are you curious about the mock bikes? Sure. Oh, you're just going really fast on talking. That's cool. Looks tough. This is the stunt one, I think. I can't read it when you do that, man. Alright, well, cool. I'm gonna leave. Just not even worry about it. I don't think you get the bike until after you beat Misty. Nah, I could be mistaken on that one. Whoa, it's a Voltor. Hey, hiker dude. <laughs> Electro, do you sl what, what? No, no, not that move. Oh, Pokemon are so hard to control. They say it ups your skills as a trainer whether your Pokemon listens to you or not. Yeah. Seen any rare kidneys? I've never found one at a shop. Well, I mean, nearby. But I have found one laying around uh, somewhere. So got it actually. Once you defeat a gym leader and get a new badge, you should visit the local shops. It should have new items that you could buy. It's a sign that you've become a stronger trainer. Which makes me wonder. Like when you go to buy sh to a shop, do you like show them like, boy, here's my badges. So I have three now. I should be able to get that item. No, sir, you need four badges to buy that one. But I have like 20,000 credits. Come on. I don't think we need anything current. Ooh. 
Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about those right now. All right, I'm out. Nothing there. Gotta cut that tree down later. Let's go ahead and go to the Pokemon Mart. Not, uh, not Mart, but let's rest the Pokemon up real quick. Pikachu needs a little healing. Crack this can up real quick. Thanks, Nurse Joy. Hey, it's another old man. Okay, so Bill for sure is in the game. He's a Pokemon fanatic. What? If a collection like his, who wouldn't want to brag a bit about it? I think people are just jealous. Okay. So let's answer my question. <gasps> yes, because you have the Loa version of Retire, don't you? Why can't I trade the other one? That's weird. Come on. There we go. Trade. Woot. Hmm. Now that I'm doing this, I'm wondering. Because there, there are shiny versions of the Loha Pokemon. The Aloha. Aloha. From Sun and Moon. And, um. Hmm. I wonder if you trade a shiny to them, will you get a shiny back? I'll we'll probably hold off on doing that until I know for sure from here on out. Unless you can constantly trade. Oh, that's Bill. I heard he'll do anything to get his hands on a rare Pokemon. Anything at all. Your picture looks very promising. I'm pretty sure that Pikachu can learn the marvelous moves that I've developed. Um, sure. What Zippy is that? Oh, that's one of the special moves. It's a 50 hundred. User attacks, target with a burst of electricity at high speeds. Moves always goes first. And re Ooh. Always goes first and results in a critical. That is better than Thundershock. But the fact that Thundershock may leave them paralyzed, but the fact that it's 50 power naturally and crit. We're getting rid of our Thundershock. No, no, it's fine, because I have a normal attack, fighting attack, electric type, still. So I'm still good. Why don't you trade Pokemon with your friends? You could get a lot more variety by trading. Your Pokemon you get trades growing quickly. There are two types of attacking moves, physical moves and social moves. If your Pokemon attack stats is high, teach it physical moves. Not sure why that kid has such a deep voice for him, or grown-up voice. There's the gem. I'm going to ignore the gem for right now. You're a trainer, too. Collecting Pokemon, battling a Pokemon, it's a tough life, isn't it? Actually, I think I have to fight Misty before I do anything else, truly. Only skilled trainers can collect gem badges. I see you have at least one. Maybe I'll tell you something interesting. Well, oh! Trivia. Now then, which of the eight badges should I describe? Oh, I, I, it's okay. Let's just do the soul one. Oh, I thought I'd be answering questions. All right. There's another rare candy.
Hmm. So I wonder if the whole backyard is just yours or do you share it with your neighbors? What? Um, okay, tall ceilings much. <laughs> that was out of well, Onyx is such a good boy. Hey, Onyx. Wow. The tall ceiling you got there. Hey, it's Officer Jenny. Team Rocket. Alright. Hey, buddy. Oh, Bancroft. You gotta. You're, go you're not gonna believe this. P -p -p Pokemon. It's a. It, ah. Wait. That leads into a battle? What? How does that lead into a. Okay. Alright, let's do this, Leo. You're starting strong with Pidgey, huh? Alright. We'll just do Zippy Zap and test this move out for once now that I got it. Oh. Dang. I like the fact that it didn't even show the health bar go down. It just was gone. Alright. Oh, nice. Pidgey, level 17. Congrats. Roost. Is that the healing move? The user lands, uh, rests its body. This move restores user HP up to half of its maximum hold. Yeah, uh. Oh, man. Uh. Alright, so Gust is a 40. Target inflicting damage. Wing attack. Closing wings widespread to inflict damage, so 60. Quick attack, just that nice normal. Alright, we're getting rid of Gustin. Alright. Get your way if you keep yourself alive longer whenever you have to come out. And one more level, Pidgey. You're a Pidgeotto. I think. I think it's 18. Oh, you got an Oddish. Now we're gonna keep battling Pikachu. Cause like always guys, my goal is to make Pikachu like Ash's Pikachu in the sense where, you know, Ash, yes, okay, Ash used a lot of other Pokemon, but my goal is just to use Pikachu and Pikachu only until there's no other choice for me to switch. Or unless I do a double swipe, cause when you doubles, you have to use more than one Pokemon. But until then, I am just using Pikachu. I use Pikachu just for uh, Brock's gym, beat Brock. Um, all of his people are just Pikachu. I'll do the same for Misty's gem, which is a go figure because it's water types. Oh. That was a bad idea. Alright, we're gonna zippy zap this. Dang, that move is nice. I mean, the fact, I guess the fact that it's a crit makes it so much better. Ah, uh, being poisoned is not a good thing. Alright, this should be his last one. Unless I can't do math, uh, we're going to keep battling. Yes, yeah, his last one. We're just going to straight from Zippy Zap. That seems to be very powerful, very effective. So again, this is a normal Pokemon. I probably should have done double instead. But <laughs> there we go. Zippy Zap for the win. That that is amazing. <laughs> Phew. Okay, I feel a bit calmer now. I, I hope. I mean, I don't understand how you freaking out led to a battle. But come on, Leo. What's going on? Uh, deep breaths. Okay, let me try that again. 
Sorry, it's not like me to lose my cool like that. Yeah, you just like pretty much push me and throw a Pokeball in my face as you try to fight. There's a house up ahead where this famous Pokemon fanatic is supposed to live. I wanted to stop by because I thought maybe you can see people in the background who have to get a fight later. That's awesome. But what I found, and don't freak out when you hear this, the Pokemon fanatic Bill wasn't there. Instead, it was a Pokemon that that talked. Um. Okay, Leo. That's a bit. A Pokemon, a Pokemon that talks. That's not possible. Nugget Bridge, huh? Beat us five trainers and win a fabulous prize. Yeah, I got what it takes. Obviously, my friend just run right past all of you, but he must have already beaten you then. Oh. Interesting choice. Oh, Pikachu's still poison. Crap. Alright, let's start with a double kick first. Okay, I'm, not, I'm not sure how effective it's gonna be. Oh, man. I gotta remember that. I make that mistake a lot. I can remember my types. Alright, well, good thing it's not hurting me too much. That poison, though, is gonna do some damage. I gotta get rid of that poison fast. I do have an antidote in my backpack. I'm going to use that after this battle. Nice. Thanks for the Pokeballs, though. <laughs> Alright. Let's go ahead and heal up... Uh, controllers all there we go let's go ahead and heal up the Pikachu because he'll be in poison is not gonna continue not be good at all so we'll go ahead and do that if he'll be at 31 out of 52 I'm going to use a potion as well gonna at max health and don't think I gotta worry about anything else what's this for up to 10 points all right not gonna worry about that because I got like 12 more for uh, zippy zap I feel like this bridge is a lot of bullies on this bridge. Like, what if I just wanted to walk by and not get a prize at the end? What if I just wanted to go and see my supposed friend Bill? Like, how do you guys not know he's my friend? Now you're inter interfering with me. But I guess I get free money out of it and potentially Pokeballs, so I'm okay with it. Good job. Alright. How can you lose? It happens. Electric against water always wins with electric. Alright, number three. Question is, what you got there, Timmy? I always want to say a Weedle just because of his shirt. But okay, Sandtree works for me. Hmm, Sandtree's a ground type. So we're going to use Double Kick and potentially take you out in one go. Ah. Oh. Alright. Poison Sting? Don't get poisoned. Uh, okay. I don't have any more antidotes. That was not a cool thing. Hmm. Can I beat the next two people without having more about Pikachu going down? I think I could do it. What happens, man? Thanks for the Pokeballs. Thanks for the money.
There were four. Mm -hmm. Don't say. Do a quick, quick attack. Oh, come on. Uh, worry about that later. Those were level 15. Nice. Number five. You think you're gonna stomp me? Come on, kid. Let's see what happens. All right, Kevin. Think you got what it takes? Ooh, a Growlithe. Nice. All right. Ah, uh, picture's still poisoned. Don't have any antidotes yet. We'll just go with Zippy Zap first. Get that crit out of the way. Hopefully it does enough damage. <laughs> oh my goodness, that move is amazing. Alright, Pikachu. If I recall correctly, I should get a nugget for this. Congratulations, you beat our five trainers. And you earned a fabulous prize. You got a nugget. Okay. Well, thanks. And... Hey, Charmander's up there. Sweet. Wait. Okay, so you, you let my friend run by twice, obviously. What, did you guys beat him or something? I don't... <laughs> oh, man. You're going to lose, buddy. I still love this intro and the way they start this off. I don't know why... All right. I'm just gonna zippy zap that. I mean, <laughs> it's a flying electric. It's not gonna last long. Sorry, you got one more. What do you got? Bring it out. Ah, uh, poison. Oh, it's a coughing. No, we can't switch Pokemon. Alright. Let's go ahead and do a just a quick attack then. Probably should have zippy zap again, but quick attack should be uh Just do quick attack again. I mean, look at the guy's face. He knows he's going to lose. Sorry, man. I ain't joined Team Rocket. But give me their outfit and I'll wear it. I'm not joining you guys, though. But hopefully if I wear your outfit, no one will bother me again. <laughs> look so shocked. For your skills, you could become a top leader in Team Rocket. Come on, think of the opportunities. You shouldn't let a chance like this pass you by. What? Huh? He just, like, disappeared. Oh, well. 
I gotta go and get my Pokemon taken care of real quick. Or at least buy some antidotes. A lot of people have poison in this area. Alright, so we didn't get a chance to actually get to Bill's house just quite yet. Um, we're gonna get a few items and then head back to his place to see what exactly is different. Because we do know he's in this game, we just don't know what they changed. Because like I said, Bill didn't make the Pokebox in this game. <laughs> Did he make the Poke Bag? I'm not really sure on that. I can't wait to find out. And I'm really curious if he's still a Pokemon like he's always been. Until next time, guys. Thanks for checking out our Let's Play on Pokemon uh, Let's Go Pikachu. And take care.